welcome to Go Engineer. My name is Christine Thurlman, and I'm going to show you what is new in Sketch Tools. SolidWorks has always had really powerful uh, sketching and inference tools, and now they've made it even easier. Uh, one of the nice things that they've added is They've added sketch relation pop-ups on termination of a sketch. For example, when I terminate this tangent arc, the tangent relation comes up. And when I draw a straight line, the line relation options come up. So I'm going to go ahead and select make vertical. Uh, when creating a spline, we also have new relations that pop up, such as perpendicularity, tangent, and uh, equal curvature. We're going to go ahead and say tangent. We're going to make all of our lines perpendicular. You can also select two sketches and the available relation options will come up. We're going to go ahead and select tangent. Another cool feature that SOLIDWORKS has added, I'm going to go ahead and select the S key, is a midpoint line. So I'm going to start my sketch here from this construction line and go out and as you can see uh, it creates a symmetrical line about this construction line. I'm just going to add a couple lines here. And as you can see, as you move this, your line stays symmetrical. Uh, another cool feature is adding construction lines to any type of rectangle. Um, you can do midpoint or corner lines. Let's go ahead and make a, a midpoint square or rectangle. I'll just throw some dimensions on here. Uh, this is nice because it makes it really easy to attach it to another point. We're going to create that here. Moving on to the next new feature, uh, you can now chain select construction lines. You right click, select chain, so our entire chain has been selected and we're going to uncheck this as a construction line. Go ahead and make our line horizontal. A new feature in dimensions, you can now easily uh, not only select half of your angle but your whole angle by holding down the shift key. And SOLIDWORKS now remembers what your reference line was. So now if I go over here to my second angle, it will automatically select the center line as my uh, center line. Okay. All right, we can now uh, segment our lines and have automatic relations added. So I'm going to go ahead and say sketch segments. Come over here. As you can see, I already have relations, collinear and linear. I'm going to go ahead and delete this relation, modify my part. All right. Uh, we can also do this segment sketch with 
with circles. I'm going to add a couple of segments here. And I'm going to add the fully defined sketch relation so that I can define my sketch. And you can always, if you need to update these, you can always delete them and update them as you go. So that's what's new with SOLIDWORKS 2015 Sketch Tools. Thank you for watching. Once again, my name is Christine Thurlman here at Go Engineer.